I've been in politics in my country, I've been a minister. So when this kind of thing happens, it's very natural for leaders and politicians to want to take care of their own population. There's nothing wrong with that. The problem we do have is that the pandemic is a problem of the global commons. So taking care of your population and being nationalistic with respect to vaccines won't work this time. Because even if you get all of them vaccinated and there's a country down the road that hasn't done that, the, the, it will come back in the way of variants. So one of the things that uh, one would like to do is to work very hard to see on what the WTO can do with the, under the TRIPS agreement uh, to, to use all the flexibilities possible to allow uh, countries to manufacture the uh, available vaccines so that there can be more for poor countries quickly. And this will be a great support to the COVAX facility, which Gavi and the WHO have put together. Actually, the WHO, Gavi and CEPI have put together what is called the ACT Accelerator, which I mentioned in my speech, designed to speed up availability of all these things to poor countries. So um, how can WTO support that by, uh, uh, by exercising, members exercising these flexibilities?